Hi and welcome to the Freelance Channel. My name is Florante and in today's video, I'm going to help you resolve the problem when you're trying to cash in from PayPal to Gcash and you get this message that tells you that you have reached the pre-approved limit. So here's a quick way on how you can resolve this. First thing that you need to do is to, of course, open your browser and log into your PayPal account. Now, for this tutorial, just to make sure that we are on the same page, I'm using a business account. So if you're using a personal or a premier account, you may be able to find my interface a little different. But if you're making use of a business account, this is where you're going to go first. All right. Once you're logged into your PayPal account, you have to go to the profile. So you just have to click on the cog icon, which you can find on the upper right hand of your window. And then click on profile settings. Okay, once you're on the profile settings window, you just have to click on the financial information. And then scroll down just about the bottom of the page, you will see there the manage pre-approved payments. And yes, what you're seeing there was correct. That's a typo and that's from PayPal. But that's where you need to go and you just have to click on that manage pre-approved payments. And from here you will see that for me, I have a couple of pre-approved payment plans. Okay, so from this page, what you need to do is to delete all those pre-approved payment plans. Okay, you just have to click on that and then click on cancel. There you go, delete. Once you have deleted all those pre-approved payment plans from Gcash, you can go ahead and go back to your Gcash app and relink your Gcash account to your PayPal. And that should go perfectly this time. So that's all good now. So that's how you resolve the issue with cashing in from PayPal to Gcash because of the pre-approved limits. And once you have signed in, you just proceed as usual with your cash in process. You just enter the amount, then choose which currency or which balance you're going to withdraw from and just have to wait for the confirmation. Thank you so much for watching and if you have any questions about this video or if you have any suggestions and topics that we'll cover, please feel free to leave it in the comments or you can also email me at info at florontevaldez.com. Thank you so much for your time and for your support on this channel. I hope you have a great day.